going on, neutral? What's going on, yeehaw? Everybody, guys, thanks for being here. Let's do some runs. Last night we got a four hit PB with a couple of memes in it. So tonight we're going to try to do the same thing just with, with fewer memes. Hey, Yed, nice to see you, dude. How are you? I feel like the game looks dark. I need to pump that brightness a little bit. You're doing well? Nice. Glad to hear that. I'm feeling, like, kind of, uh, sick today. Which is why stream was so late tonight. But... Decided to make it just a nice, chill night. Not worry about it too, too much, you know? That's true. They do call it Dark Souls. The souls do be dark, though. I installed a, uh, what's it called? A reshade? So the colors should be popping a little bit more. Yo, nice yeeha. They're like one of the first big walls in this game, I feel like. Insane damage, dude. Whoa, 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 sir. That's what I thought he was going to do. How's the volume, guys? Can y'all hear everything okay? Let me know if anything's too loud. We're kind of bumping the tunes tonight. Not cursed. Good first gun deer. It's a good sign, baby. You'll love to see it. Dude, I didn't do shit today, guys. I slept so much. I just I just did not do shit. It was great. Kind of. It was great in some senses, you know? In others, I was, you know, feeling unwell, but that's okay. Uh, let's go get these first, actually. Dude, I'm loving this new playlist. 
I just need it to be longer. It's just like so hard to find songs that I feel like fit it, you know? Like, this is probably the pickiest I've been with a playlist before. All right, let me actually fix these. Whoops. Yeah, I'm digging this reshade. It just makes everything look just like a little bit more vibrant, you know? Oh, the first try tree skip too? I'll take it, man. We gotta run some errands around Firelink real quick. I'll drop one of, no, do not drop 16 of them. Just drop one. I don't think the bird wants 16 of these. I'll grab this too while we're here. Alright, I think we're ready to get out of here. Dude, I think we can get this run like, I've been saying it every night, man. I think we can get this run like any day now. It feels really good. And it's nice to be like doing runs and feeling good about them again, you know? That feels really nice. There was a while where I was very burnt out, and every time I came back and I played the game, I was still burnt out on it. I'm very happy that hasn't been the case this time. Just having a great time, honestly. Oh, God. I know what I did do today. I, uh, I've been watching Gino Machino, uh, do his, his Skyrim runs. He's been doing damageless, uh, Skyrim. He did any percent on novice damageless. And then he did any percent on legendary damageless. And it looks pretty sick. It actually looks like fun. It's kind of crazy. But then he, he started doing uh, Dawn Guard today and it looks insanely hard. Even on, even on Novice, it looks hard. There's just like so many more enemies, you know? It's cool, though. It's nice to see Gino like, crushing another game besides DS3, you know? G 
Chat, have you clubbed your grandma today? How long does the Skyrim run take? Uh, a long time, actually. Like, I think the, like, any percent run was something like three hours, I think. Uh, for, like, the harder mode. And Gino's really efficient, too. So, like, three hours for Gino is, like, <laughs> like, five hours for most people. The guy plays video games on Fast Forward, man. Not literally, but, like... Uh, okay. Well, it's funny, June, because the, um, the main story is, like, not actually that good compared to, uh, the rest of the game. Got a fight. Bort of the Voreal Valley. Yeah, June, you're playing the game right. Like, Skyrim is very much the type of game where you just, like... I think the best way to play it is just fuck off and do whatever you want, you know? Elder Scrolls 6 is coming out in like four years. Allegedly. Yeah, we should do some Skyrim together. Damn, you can really see the reshade on Vort here. Dude, I need a mod that makes it so that it, it replaces like all of the the sound effects for when I hit enemies with like the bonk sound effects. Actually, I saw a DS1 mod earlier today where, hang on, I got to focus now.
All right, sick. So yeah, I saw a mod for DS1 earlier today where it was Sif, the boss that holds the sword or the dog with the sword, but they modded it so that Sif was like a Shiba Inu or whatever it is, like from the meme. And uh, he was holding the big club. And every time he hit something with the club, it made the bonk sound effect. It was so good. <laughs> Yo, Ghost, it's such a sick mod. I don't, I don't know. I don't remember the name of it, but I think it was like, like Doge Bonk Soul, something with Doge and Bonk. I don't, I don't know if they like had other bosses like that, because I don't really know how you would do other bosses besides just Sif, you know? Horrible mod concepts? Sounds like you would be a great modder. Like the most cursed shit ever. Let me introduce you to a mod known as Dongs of Skyrim. Dying from the plague or something? Something like that. I was feeling like super... Like earlier today, I um... Hi Nerdin, by the way. Like I was feeling sick earlier, but I was also feeling like emotionally not so great. And... Like I can stream while feeling sick. Because like streaming's not that hard. Um, but I can't stream while feeling sick and like struggling emotionally, you know, and like feeling overwhelmed in that regard. So, you know, six o'clock, my normal start time, I was like, nah, it's not happening. And then, you know, sat down and chilled out for like an hour and a half and feeling better now. Sometimes it do be like that. It's been a nap filled day, yeah. I, I, don't, I still have no idea how long I slept earlier. But it felt like a really, really long time, I don't know. All my sleep has been so weird. Like, I've been having weird dreams and, like, definitely, like, fever dreams, you know? It was so strange. Like, this afternoon, um, I had a dream where, like, I think in my dream, I, re I realized that, like, my body, you know, knew that I was, like, lying down. But everything in my dream felt like like gravity was oriented in the it's hard to describe but like you know if I was standing up in my dream it felt like gravity was pulling me you know backwards because you know I was laying down on the ground so I would like you know go to move my arm forward in my dream and it felt like it was being pulled backwards it's frustrating as shit Some of the absolute silliest mods I've seen. Uh, there's a mod for DS1 called the Boneless Mod, where it just makes it look like nothing has bones. That might be the silliest one I've seen, honestly. 
where there are cats everywhere. They can't hurt you and you can't hurt them, but you can pet them. That sounds like a good mod. Yeah, my sleep last night and my sleep this afternoon were just all... They were just... It was just so fucked. Nice. Nice freaking throw, Josh. Well done. God gamer. This playlist do be banging though. No. Doggos did not want to cooperate. I gotta, I gotta split. All oh, those candles looked so nice. Y'all see that? <laughs> yeah, very uh, hyper realistic doggos in this game. Refusing to cooperate. Nice. Boris has given us the good attacks. Thank you. Nice. Dude, I wonder if, like, someday we'll actually understand what causes dreams and, like, what, what affects them and stuff like that. Because that's one of those things I feel like right now, modern medicine is just like, nah, dude, we got no idea. We got literally no idea what causes dreams and why. <laughs> yeah, Dusty's napping on the bed behind me. He's in his little pillow fort. Because, like, there are the universal dreams that, like, everyone's had, you know? Like, the, the very common stress dreams, I feel like. You should let Dusty try a run. Yeah, probably so. I think he'd crush it, honestly. I don't know if my pride could handle that sort of, like... Like, being shown up to that degree by a cat, you know? Plus the stuff I say. I mean, like Nerdin said, I've I'm an HR nightmare, all right? Yeah, the teeth dream. Everyone's had the teeth dream. Maybe. Hey, what up, Mitch? Yeah, I started I started up kind of late tonight. Imagine having a stream schedule. You know? Who even does that, man? Imagine having an illness. 
I don't know what that's like. Sorry. Can't imagine. <laughs> Dude, this song is so good, man. Like, very rarely do I just stop talking to listen to the music during stream, but like, man. That's the danger of this playlist. <laughs> I got you, nerded. They just finished Metal Gear Solid 3 at SGDQ. Are those games like... Like, entertaining to watch people speedrun? I don't think I've ever seen a Metal Gear Solid game run before. I feel like the the later games probably aren't the best to speedrun. But those games are fucking goofy. Don't hit me. Nice. There's just so much, so many like iconic, goofy voice lines from Metal Gear, from the Metal Gear Solid games, you know. <laughs> I was actually thinking about like changing up some of my alert sounds to just be like like iconic sounds from old games, you know. Or like quotes, maybe. The only bad thing about having my alerts be music is that like, it doesn't sound very good when I'm already playing music. It just sounds like a bad remix, you know? Nope. I needed to do what like some of the other Souls Runners have done and just like get clips of other streamers saying things either, you know, saying either funny things or like ill-advised things. That's what I need to do. <laughs> the teeth dream or the naked in public dream? That's kind of a hard one. Uh, I mean, uh, probably the teeth dream. Sunset is... Oh, man. I've got the window closed. That way I can I can maintain maximum degeneracy. I would hate to absorb any vitamin D on accident, you know? The teeth dream. Yeah, so earlier we were talking about dreams. And how they're like the classic dream... Like the classic stress dreams. The ones where you're like, you know... 
you forgot that you have a an exam your your teeth are falling out you got like the classic ones you know you know you're in you're you're in public naked and i feel like basically like the teeth dream i'm a bad bitch and don't you forget it Allie. oh go, go. ali hello nice to see you but i feel like i feel like objectively the teeth dream is the more is like the more horrific one and then the i only have two firebombs shit but i i think that the naked and public one is more stressful for me Nice to see you, Gibbo. Hello, Gibbo. Ah, oh, beautiful, dude. Two is all we need, baby. So based on your weapons, you're doing a shield only run? Oh yeah, shield only. Poggers. Actually, we're doing a staff bonk only. Allie, I was lurking during your run earlier. And I think that I stopped watching around Miko. How did the how did the rest of the run go? Hey, what up parrot? How you doing? Match PB, let's go. Only dealing damage by stop by stepping on enemies. Now we're talking. Finally, a no-hit run revolving around feet. Nobody's been brave enough to do it yet. Nerd in the naked one is your top? Yeah, same. Also, that sentence is kind of weird out of context, I guess. But, uh... <laughs> I think, like... One of the most concerning, not concerning, but like stressful dreams that I've had was I had a dream that I got raided by like, like a, like a, like a fucking 10,000 viewer Andy, like randomly, like out of the blue blind raid. And only at that moment did my, uh, like, did I realize that I was naked in the dream? And everyone was like, LMAO, streamers naked, haha. I was paying attention. That, did, that lizard didn't land on me, did it? I was reading chat. Hi, Giga Shadow. Nice to see you. Wet Nurse had her back to you when she did Nightmare Phase animation. I didn't dodge it right because she's never done that before. Yeah, doesn't normally she like looks at she like looks at you first? That's weird. Goddamn Wet Nurse. Ashen. You did what? Nice job on matching PB though. Uh, yeah, I give you the ashes for sure. And then buy like twenty more fire bombs. Nightmare phase has always been tricky for me to dodge. Yeah, that that's good, right? Nope, don't got this. Yeah, we were talking dreams because, like, I had, I've had some weird-ass dreams. Like, today and last night. I've been, I've been a little sick, and uh, I, I had some wild fever dreams. <laughs> Shit was kind of crazy. Yo, DS3 do be looking pretty, though, honestly. I installed a, a reshade preset. 
Looks nice. Weird ass dreams? Yeah. Weird dreams about asses. You be looking pretty. Got him. Not as pretty as Josh. Oh my god. Chat's trying to get in my pants again. <laughs> oh, hello, sir. Go fight the Gru. You know? High five. What the fuck, dude? Yikes, dude. All right, Red's dead. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> hey, Hellhound. Hell yeah. On the fist only split of the run. All right, red's up again. Gosh darn it, dude. Sorry, right, red did damage. You couldn't just, like, let me have a moment, you know? Oh, yeah, dude. Me and the clone are going to get some alone time. Oh, hey, Red. Nice. Ah, oh, nice. <laughs> Look, it's never a bad time for proctology, okay? Good job, Red. <clears throat> it's 
insert. Wait, I was supposed to throw a firebomb. Hey, what up, Swed? Oh, nice quoting action, Nerdin. I I respect your dedication to keeping things accurate. Good to see you, Sweat. I hope you're doing good, man. I haven't gotten the... the triple firebomb in a little while. Damn, we got some really <laughs> our quote uh our quote list is pretty good. What are we at? 271? Damn. Or you could have deleted it altogether. Now, this is fine. Ah, I failed the, uh, the jank lever pull, man. Oh, interesting. I wonder if it, like, removes the quote, but it doesn't actually, like, shift everything down. It probably doesn't, honestly. Yeah.
Yo, what up, Carrot? How you doing? We got a bony friend. I actually just, like, I can't be bothered to kill that guy. I'll just Homeward Bone back. God, I love this line. All right, we can we can make the the worm a bit quieter here for this segment. Hi, chat. How you doing? Y'all doing good? Hope you're doing good. Hope you had a good Tuesday, guys. Hope y'all are vibing. Summoning salt. Yeah, you know. Sweat nose, dude. God, I haven't watched a summoning salt video in a while. I need to get my fix, dude. If you don't know who summoning salt is, he's got these amazing videos on just like varying speed runs. And he'll make you care about shit that you didn't know you cared about. Like, I have no interest really in like Mike Tyson's punch out until summoning salt started doing a video on it, you know? I'm like, holy shit. But that's a worm on a string. Are you talking about one of those like toys that you like? You make them like go between your fingers and stuff? Little furry worms? That's canonically what that is now. I gotta turn the game volume back up. Historical documentaries. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, chat. This is Todd. Todd the giant rat. Me and Todd, we go way back. Yeah, that's the one, June. Nah, 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 nah. We can sell these. I... Okay, chat. We have upgraded from small chub to extra large chub. I hope you guys appreciate my chub. Farewell, Ashen. Oh. I was supposed to buy more skulls. Ashen. It's okay. And more bones, actually, as well. Three chubs total. I, you know... 
I originally had a small chub, a half chub, and then our large chub. And I, I decided not to get half chub anymore. I decided to go straight from small chub to full chub. I'm sorry to all my half chub fans out there. It's nothing personal. Oh god. Okay, Jesus. Knew it, dude. I almost didn't attack, uh, because I was worried about her staggering. Full chub speed run, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, chat. I came up with a new strat for this part. Worms on strings. What is what is with you and worms on strings? Any candelabras? Is that what this thing is? This thing's a candelabra, right? What up, Sky Hunter? So that's the new slow and safe strat for that.
I like to skull that guy too because he's ended too many of my runs. He just sucks, man. He's got one super quick attack. It's like all of his attacks are fairly easy to dodge except for one that just comes out so fast. That was, uh, that was Boris of the Boreal Valley. <laughs> He's chill. Don't worry about him. Yeah, so we're doing no hit, staff only. It's not like 100% staff only because... I use fire bombs sometimes and also like my fist sometimes. But the staff is the only weapon I use. Staff bonk only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't use any stinky spells or anything like that either. Who reads titles nowadays? Nerds. Tell me you're... Keep hitting me with the bad ideas, June. But so help me God, if there's another worm on a string on this mod. Hey, what up, Mike? Good to see you. Ah, shit. Saved. Is it possible to beat the game with only fists? Oh, yeah, totally. People have done it uh, no hit before. Twin princes on roller skates. My god. I like the roller skates idea. That's your best idea yet, I think. There are no flat surfaces. Oh my god, you're so right. This just in. Lothric is not ADA compliant. Shut him down. Shut that bitch down. 
Yeah, the damage is actually kind of sick, Ghost, right? This dog hit me last time, so... So sleepy, but you don't know if you want to sleep yet? Maybe just some nice, chill resting. Nothing wrong with that. How many OSHA violations? Yeah, the, the, this would be shut down in a heartbeat. This run's getting faster, guys. What stats do they scale with? Uh, this stat, or er, the scaling's really, really shitty. But it scales with uh, strength and dexterity. Like, very badly. <laughs> And then the, the spell buff scales with uh, intelligence most of the time. It's probably a little faster if I bone back to shrine there since we don't have to mash through the uh, gale dialogue. Yo, what's up, hell? Nice to see you. Ooh, woo, indeed. Oh shit, yeah, no, it's PB4 now. I forgot to update, update the title, Ghost. Good catch. Imagine getting PBs. Okay, we've already bought most of the things we need. Uh, you know what, though? I did forget. I want to go back to Cleansing Chapel real quick. It's going pretty well, hell. I'm feeling, like, sick right now. But I'm good otherwise. What up, Latfi? What's the name of the music? It's called Resonance by Home. It's very good. There's a big storm. Enjoy the storm. I hope y'all stay safe and dry. I love storms. Good run, by the way. Thank you. It's going well so far.
Holy fuck, that was way too close. That's why we roll right there. I have, a, I have an extra black firebomb that I don't really need. Probably just unequip it. Or throw it at this guy. Do I always reset when I get hit? Nah, not always. Sometimes though. If I get hit early enough. Oh, I missed. That's fucked up. Yo, me too, June. That's too late there. Yeah. good I kind of wish I knew of a faster way to do this without having to kill the giant Dude, this is a stressful song, man. Sounds like people are underwater, man. Is Deacon's a tough fight? Yeah, kinda. Like, in theory, they're not that difficult, but in practice, they can be a little scary. There's just, like, so much that they can do. Let's heal that up, too. Get our Lloyd Sword Ring. I think we one-shot this guy now. We don't. Not quite. We don't have the strength just yet. Ah, oh, hell yeah, June. The hottest... Wait. <laughs> the hottest lo Lukes in staff bonking? Well, you heard right. Okay, so we need to do that then. For that thrall, we need to put on the uh, the fire ring. One oh five, making decent time so far. This song is very good. So I guess now we'll do Dragon Slayer armor. We've already got our plus four. 
Ah, wrong bonfire. Damn. Legacy, what do you think of my extremely long staff? It's huge. This staff is at least like, we got to speculate, like how long is this staff? It's like eight or eight or nine feet at least, right? Any mob enemies? Yeah. It's just because there's so much like random shit that they can actually do. Hey, what up, Sunrun? Nine feet, yeah, right? Nice to see you, son. That sounded like I was talking to you as if you were my child. My son has finally arrived. Oh, so is my dad. Hi, Mikey Venture. All right. Um, I might need to mute the music for this fight. are coming down. All right, sick. We're in good shape. Mikey, how you doing, man? We'll go to Firelink and level up and then do Deacons. This is kind of like inefficient here, but that's okay. Mikey absolutely streams. Wait. Oh, wait, no, it's actually good that we came back right now because we need to buy this. Ashen one. How am I feeling? Honestly, like, not so great in terms of, like, health. But, uh, outside of that, you know, not bad. A little, a little bit, just mildly stressed about feeling better for the charity festival. But the run's going great. And that's, that's a big pog. Hello, Mr. Patches. 
I'd like to buy... Fuck it, let's go 20. Of your finest alluring skulls, thank you. Hi, planning to play in the festival? Um, I was planning on doing a... A crowd-controlled... DS3 run. But I might have to change that plan. Because... Somebody was saying that, like, maybe with Tiltify, it, it you can only do crowd control through Tiltify if you're donating to St. Jude. And, like, maybe there weren't other options, which would be unfortunate. So if I can't do to right love on our arms, then I'll have to come up with something else. Uh oh. Psych. I know it's like, imagine, dude. That scared me so much, dude. A randomizer like your grandpappy. That's definitely a good option. T-Storm just rolled in. Nice. Assuming that's a nice thing that you get to enjoy. Can't really get in there. Dude, I love thunderstorms. I think growing up in Texas made thunderstorms just like... Like, thunderstorms were always such a treat because for the majority of, you know, my childhood and stuff, Texas was in a drought. We were in a drought for, like, 12 years or something like that. And, uh, as soon as our drought stopped, basically, uh, the California drought started. <laughs> that guy could have hit me. But yeah, like thunder and rain and lightning is just like it's one of those things that are that are truly truly comforting. Oh, that's awesome, Mikey. Fuck yeah. You guys are still aggroed to me, huh? Wow, dude. All right, we gotta we gotta group you guys back up. All right. Which state? A super drought? Oh my god, it's like a drought but with superpowers. on the small deacon, right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, 
Oh, that's actually pretty bad. One, two, three. Definitely could have been worse. Yo, thanks, Giga. D Gons, yeah. Get him out of here, dude. Jesus Christ. Bless you, Patch. Nice to see you. Enjoy your lurks, Patch. Favorite boss? Are we talking in the whole game or just uh, the any percent that we're doing right now? It's kind of hard to say. I really like Frida. Objectively wrong. Damn. That's cold. I like Frida. I like Demon Princes. I like Cinder. Nameless King is okay. What is this Dino emote? He's a beaut. The giant monster we just murdered. That's that's a word for sure. Ah, uh, hello, King. It's so nice to see you. You've picked a good night for it. Hey, what up, Doofish? Nice to see you guys. Thanks for being here. You did it it? What did you do? Wait, wait, wait. What? Tell me what you did. Um. Last I was watching, you were on Demon Princes. You finished DS3? Damn, you finished it? Holy shit. King is uh, very good at video games, and also is like just it's it's very impressive. All right, so now that you've finished it, what's your favorite 
Do you have a favorite encounter or boss or anything like that? King is just like really effective at learning like quickly. Dancer's a really cool one. I like Dancer for sure. Oh yeah, Frida. We were just talking about Frida. I love Frida. Sounds good, Allie. Enjoy your lurkies. Thanks for hanging out. The bosses that I didn't really like very much on my first playthrough, uh, I've grown to like since then. Like Cinder, Twin Princes. You just beat Twin Princes? Nice. They're pretty cool. The reshade is back, yeah. This reshade is nice too. I like it. It just makes the it's like not super super noticeable, but uh, it makes all the colors like pop. Oh yeah, Gale's pretty sick. Like, you, you kind of, the way, I, I look at all these fights from, like, two different perspectives. There's, like, the the first fight, like, the first time fighting experience, and then there's, like, the, you know, thousandth time fighting them experience, you know? And, like, Gale and Madeir were both, like, really good first experiences. But, like, kind of not as good. Super late. And then Abyss Watchers... I think Abyss Watchers are really, really good for your first playthrough. And, like, you know, your first few playthroughs. But then, like, for no hit, Abyss Watchers... I hate them. Yeah, Madeir... I didn't beat Madeir until I started speedrunning this game. I, uh, well, I did. I did beat Madeir, but I had, I summoned somebody to basically beat him for me. Avion, how you doing, man? Nice to see you. Yo, Star-Lord, thanks for the follow. How does the summon thing work? Can you only use it sometimes? Kinda, yeah. I mean, you you can summon anytime you want to. But, uh... There just has to be a person to summon, you know? And you also have to be embered. That's the other... kind of caveat. Wait, this way. Let's see if this works. I feel like I'm not aiming far enough to the right. 
you know? I feel like I should aim for that plant right there. Hopefully that works every time. My next emote is going to be Dankies with Mikolash. Oh my god, Ghost. That is so good. That's so fucking good. Yo, thanks for the follow. Nice to have y'all here. Thanks for being here, guys. I keep missing, dude. Ah. Oh. Well. Yeah, Sekiro is really fun. Yorm, please.
Okay. Thank you guys, thank you. We actually have to go back to Shrine, unfortunately. Erthos, thanks. Thank you, Sky Hunter. Thank you, King. Hemlocks, what's up? Appreciate it. Thanks for the follow. All right. Just gotta fight the nerves now. I hate that I still get nervous on these runs. He's fucking everywhere, Hemlocks. He can't be stopped. Can you fuck off? Thank you. <sighs> One for the road. Oh, Nerdin, sorry, I missed your message. Um, thanks for hanging out, Nerdin. We'll catch you later. Have a good night. Where do I want to drop from? I haven't, like, memorized the, the drops to make this work perfectly every time. Ah, uh, dude, I, I actually, like, I found myself missing DS2 a lot recently. That full diaper angle. Fuck yeah. That's the good shit right there. That's the shit that we do love to see. Literally. Do I do PvP at all? Uh, not really. I would, though. Seems fun. All right, this fight fucking sucks, dude. That's fucked up.
Ran out of stamina, dude. That was scary. I didn't mean to light that. <laughs> Pontiff cost you $17. He would. That motherfucker. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. I love when the staff just fucking clips into the ground. Because it's too it's too long. Like anytime we're running on a sloped surface, it's just like inside the ground. Uh that's not a skull. I would make one of the bosses scream like a goat, but I don't know which one. Bless you. <laughs> I can think of a... <laughs> I can think of a thing in this... Uh in this mod that would accompany the goat noise really well. Y'all know the dragon transformation? Every deacon makes the noise at once. I have to go delete system 32. What happens if you drop down like while the elevator's going up? <clears throat> I feel like the physics would be all weird. Okay, we actually want this just in case Aldrich does arrows. It's normal? Oh my god. Mind blown, I know, with all the janky shit in this game. That doesn't sound right. Don't die to fall damage. Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, hydration time. Good call. All right, I hydrate right now. Thank you. Fifty, eleven, uh, thirteen. 
That's perfect or too much. Hi, cow. too slow. Okay, we can't actually buff the staff there. when I leave my house I get hit by the same bike it's a vicious <laughs> cycle <laughs> it's like thanks for the bits <laughs> he's not stronger than family that's for sure Dom no He's a big slug. He may be a big slug, but I have family. What's with the Vin Diesel memes lately? Is it because of Fast and the Furious? We're at 750. Uh, I feel like I just shouldn't mess around too much here. And if we get a good attack, we should just take it. Fuck it. Yeah. We could just never get a good attack. That would be pretty sick, too. I can't believe Fast and the Furious is still happening. It's like the dumbest series ever, but actually so good. But actually the dumbest series ever. Like, fucking... Just, like... 
like the screen, like the, the, the fucking, hang on, wait. The poster is like a car with a, with a rocket strapped to the back of it or to the top of it. Have y'all seen that? It's because they're family, Josh. Well, you know what? If the moral of the story is that you can't defeat family, I guess that must be true because otherwise that movie series would be fucking done already. But you can't keep down family. Alright, Sage, you gotta come with me on a trip. Alright. Whoa! Y'all have no idea how close that was. how I feel about the Saw movies. I've, I saw one Saw movie when I was like probably too young to watch it. And now I'm like, nah, dude, there's no way I will ever enjoy a movie like that ever. I've heard they're actually like good-ish stories. I'm just like so fucking squeamish. Oh, imagine taking damage from gravity, dude. Imagine. We gotta wait for Sage to chill out a little bit. Two bosses, man. It's been a decent run so far. We do be vibing, though. Uh, PB is actually, um, it's actually four, but I forgot to up update the title. Prince Lothric's voice is sexy. That's a hot take, and I won't even be mad about it. I've never thought that because, like, you know, they kind of creep me out a little bit. But, yeah, no, there's some good, there's some, there's some great voice acting in this game. Let's go sit at this bonfire really quick. 
This run is the farthest I've ever gotten without getting hit on this run. Uh, my favorite voice actor is uh, Vort, probably. Especially when he, when he, when he, like that one time when he was like, that was, oh my God. Or like when Osiris said, uh, oh yeah, PB stands for personal best. That's a good question. Um, but like or Osiris when he's when that oh man when he said Ocelot oh man that that one hit different oh man that one really really got the the ASMR tingles going yeah Ishin is actually really good okay but go listen to Ishin's French voice actor it's like my favorite uh that's my favorite version of Ishin I think what's your peanut butter Crunchy, extra crunchy, eaten out of the jar with a fork. Why do you ask? You bitch. Concern. Oh! Dude, I wish Sky Hunter. Holy shit. Oh, when the curse rotted great wood. When he do when he was making those like wood creaking sounds. Oh yeah. That's the good stuff. That'll make the hair on the back of your neck stand up, man. <clears throat> Animation cancel, maybe? Ah, uh, I went too soon. I should have waited. My rankings of Souls games? Uh, it's hard. It's actually like a really difficult, um, it's a really difficult question. I think my, la my least favorite are probably Dark Souls 1 and then maybe Bloodborne, I'm not sure. Oh dude, Wilhelm's voice, oh yeah. Yeah, Vil Wilhelm's voice actor is delicious. Okay, chat, you ready for a super hard boss fight? That said, I like all the games. I really, really like all the games. But yeah. DS1 was not my favorite experience, I don't think. Like, Sekiro was awesome. DS2 was awesome. DS3 is really good. But DS3 is kind of like... You know, I've spent so long playing it that I'm very well acquainted with a lot of its flaws. Not fans of Bloodborne. See, I, I really liked Bloodborne, but... I don't know. DS2 is greater than DS2. You're right. 
When you're right, you're right. I don't think we're going to make this up two hours. Skip past the Dragon Slayer armor? I killed it uh, super, super early. You can't decide between Sekiro and DS1. Man, DS1's... Or Sekiro's fucking fun. <laughs> bed of Chaos. Not a fan of the Bed of Chaos, huh? My god. Skyhunter coming in here with the hot takes. Yeah, exactly, King. Hard boss time. Time for a hard boss. I think somebody just set off a firework. That's fucked up. It's the Genny strat. right now. Oh! Nutting. I'm sorry, that's, I'm not nutting right now. I just had to say that. I feel the need to clarify that I have not just nutted live on stream, okay? Chew. I'll be right with you guys. Thank you for the raid. Okay, sick. Hello, Chu and friends. Thank you so much for coming along with the raid. Hello, everyone. We are at zero hits right now. We're, we're doing a no-hit run of DS3 at the moment. Um, We haven't been hit on this run yet. And we're going into the final boss right now. Chu, how was your uh, how was your time playing Destiny Two tonight? That game is so much fun. Guys, go follow Chu. Chu is a is a ray of sunshine, and I say that with absolutely zero hint of irony. Okay, I'm gonna go into the commands. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna disable. I'm just gonna turn off the bot. Because I don't, I don't want any uh, distractions during this fight. Absolutely lovely. Oh my god, I would probably boo anybody else if it wasn't you, Chu. That game is a lot of fun. I really like that game. Hi, Zeriaf. Hi, Bamboo Tuna. Simplex, hello. Guys, thanks so much for coming in with the raid. I 
I get away with it in Mork's chat too. It's because you're the best. So zero hits so far. We're going into the final boss, which is probably like the hardest fight in this run. But I've spent a lot of time practicing lately. I think that there's a good chance that like we, I mean like we might get hit. Like Cinder's just hard. They started removing DLC? That's crazy. I didn't know about that. None of that talk. Fair enough. I, like, wish I could quit out of this and then just go practice Cinder before going into this, but it's not really how that works. Thank you, Sunrun. It's a good thing Cinder's easy, I know, right? Let me check my rings. All right. Jesus Christ.
Wow, what a stagger, dude. That's fucking weird. All right, GG. Nice. Oh, sick. Bonk only no hit. Let's go.